Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Fine Nuts at Candies 2. This might be the last night, but I think it's going to be the same as the first game or as the normal Fine Nuts of Freddy's, which will go on into the custom night, which is night 7. So, there was some kind of moth lying about, alright. So, is this going to be the same? Okay, there's blank. I mean, I found him. He disabled the cameras quick. Not a great start. Yeah, I think I'll probably die. I mean, there's nothing in my room, so I got time. So Blank works as the same as Cindy and Candy. And all the rest of your animatronics are still in the facility. That's not good. Yes, that theory is correct. They cannot go on the same camera, so that's why there's different cameras. Now it's a little bit more difficult to get rid of them because I need to be careful of where they are positioned. That's not good. The phone is blocked. Don't know how long for. And I'm dead. It's behind me. Okay, the difficulty just ramped up all the way now. Missing girl, okay, it's the same thing as before. Apparently I am working, uh, I mean I am playing as Merlin. So yeah, it's a lot more difficult and I need to be careful of where the animatronics are positioned. But I don't think it will be that difficult to complete. I just have to be careful. And obviously that phone was off for quite a lot of time, so it's not the same as before. That is Blank just making his usual noises. Or is it just an ambience noise? Because I did hear this before. Okay, it takes longer to disappear as well. Which is fine. Yeah, I need to concentrate a little bit more now. Just for where they are positioned, just like that. Candy, you are annoying. At least I got rid of her, I think. Yeah, I did. I would have been dead by now. Blank is here. I need to get rid of Chester. It does take quite a while to get inside of a vent, which is completely fine. At least I got time to get rid of these animatronics in the hallway. Once they get in the hallway. 1am. Five more hours to go. Or at least, yeah, five. Blank is back again. At least there's nobody here. That means you can just go straight away there. Get rid of Chester. Nothing in my room. I'm good. So that's all I have to do until the rest of this night. And then I think in the minigame, I will play as Cindy this time. Seeing that before I played as... No, I'm going to play as Candy, because before I was playing as Cindy. And I don't know what will happen then. I'm guessing Cindy has forgotten her bow tie. I think she has a bow tie. Yeah, she does. Seems pretty quiet for the moment. Obviously Blank does not do any sound effect. Even Candy and Cindy weirdly enough. The penguin isn't on the cameras which is great. And it's 2am. Oh, that's Blank. Heard that noise of that. I don't know if that was fast enough. I was trying to click on the cameras and it was. Okay, I have loads of time though. I don't have to be speedy on these. 
Yep. And Blank is back again. Okay. That was good enough. So yeah, this thing on the left doesn't actually do anything on these knights. Which is fine, I think it's just the for cosmetic. Just letting the facility know that this power. Nothing in my room, I can check on Chester. Get rid of Chester. And I'm fine. 3 a.m. Halfway there. It's good as well that I don't have any battery power. Otherwise that would have been awful. Because then I need to monitor how many times I flash in the hallway. And probably there will be a tactic to that as well in case I had a battery, you know. I just need to keep on phoning each uh, of the cameras. While he's ringing, not phone. Okay. Should be about 4am about now. I mean, it was 3am for quite a long time now. I think it's a minute each hour. I think I was blank there as well. I just about saw it. Yes, it was. Lucky I kind of saw that. Saw it, I saw it with a corner of my corner of my. I cannot speak. Oh, there's candy. Yeah. At least Cindy doesn't change camera there and try to block the phone. Okay. Just need to check one more time in case that animatronic was in my room, and it was. But after I flashed. Okay. Yeah. This is totally fine. I can do this. What is there going to be on night six? Our Chester is back at it again. Get out of it. Thank you. Alright. Yeah. Actually, I think that was my first ever death on the series. I just realised it. I could have did this all in one try without even knowing how to play the game. I mean, it's a pretty simple concept. I'll have to just flash and take them out. So yeah, that was my first death, I guess. Unless I can't remember it. 5am. Almost done. Oh, there's blank again. That was twice in a row we came in my room. Okay. Nothing there. Nobody's on the top cam. That means Blank will go straight away there without any interruptions. Must be done about now. Oh, there's Blank again. Not good. Okay, it listened. Thank goodness. Yeah, it should be done. Yeah. 6 a.m. Not that bad, actually. Is it gonna do the loading? Yes, it will. Am I gonna play as Candy? Yep. Search. Search for what, though? Is it a different soundtrack? Or is it the same? I think it's the same. Let's check out Blank. Blank is still here. So that's definitely not who I'm searching for. I think I'm searching for Chester or Cindy. Because Chester was missing. This door is barricaded now. So it want, the game wants me to go through the facility from the top. 
Oh. I cannot go there at all. Isn't there any secrets? What am I supposed to do? I mean, I can check on Blank again in case something has changed. Or unless I can go on the stage. No, I cannot. Weird. So they're blocking off every single passageway. Got anything to say? No, it's just there. Let's check it again. Maybe I need to go through the window. That block there looks different. And it was. Okay, so that's how they got through there. So there was a way to get in there. Good to know. Yeah, the soundtrack is completely different. I can't remember those sounds coming in. The police are here, but obviously they cannot see me because the, there's a blockage. Okay. Yeah, I cannot go past them. It's all blocked off. 1993, a year later from the last minigame. Are somebody's laughing? Sounds like a type of uh, Fred Bell laugh. Hello? I mean, the night guard has died. I don't think that was my night guard. Okay, so they do know that the animatronics are going around. Old factory set for demolition. August 2007. So this is quite in the future. The abandoned factory on St. Antonia's Road 27 has been scheduled for demolition sometime next week. The now 45-year-old factory closed in 1993 after it was deemed unsafe due to yet another fatal incident inside the factory. The death of a night guard. The factory used to belong to Robotics Corporation, a company that went bankrupt shortly after the factory closed. The company was specialised in the design and production of robotic animatronics. They started in 1962, where they made mechanical wide controlled animatronics and over the years the animatronics got more advanced. A total of 6 casualties occurred in the factory over the past 45 years. So it's not only the night guard, I think it will be the same as Finance Freddy's with the children. Unless it's like other night guards, I'm not sure about that. But 45 years, that's quite a long time. The most remembered one being in 1987. Or was it the bite? When a pair of twins went missing and were left discovered to have been killed in one of the assembly machines in the factory. That sounds awful. Best selling author solo. Okay. And that was the end. And it is a night six. But that's all for today's episode because I'm trying to keep each night on a separate video because all the lore at the endings on the minigames is actually pretty interesting to try and figure out. So in the next episode, I'll continue on night six and see what's going to happen then. But that's all for today's episode and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye, everyone.